Welcome to my video about Switch Off to Switch On, Creative Business Coaching Workshops. Creativity is insightful. It illuminates parts of ourselves hidden from our logical mind. That's point five in my Creativity Manifesto. And I'm here today to talk to you about Switch Off to Switch On, my workshops for opening up creativity. It's my signature Creative Business Coaching Workshop. I'm Louise Taylor of Creative Dynamics Arts and Business Company and I'm a creative business coach, performance poet and comedian. I've been helping clients, that's SMEs, companies in the private and public sector, associations and women's business groups discover greater resources through creativity for more than 21 years. And I bring 35 years at least of business and arts experience and wisdom. I'm a published poet. My first collection is called You Can't Cook a Poem Like an Egg and the author of a forthcoming book called The Heroine's Journey in Business. Now Switch Off to Switch On opens up participants' creativity using the transformative power of poetry fused with my golden wheel business coaching. So why do businesses need creativity? I believe that creativity can illuminate our individual paths to our authentic self, that it's essential to our future and to resolving many of the challenges that businesses face today. Let's look at some of those challenges. Change. It's constant and rapid. It often feels like we're expected or are expecting ourselves to change at the same speed as the internet, resulting in information overload, stress and poor performance. Your business needs to keep innovating and your profit growing. To do that, you need powerful performances from your staff and your key people in particular, directors, managers, sales teams. Companies today need to be focused on whole brain thinking and holistic well-being to create employment retention and employee engagement. If you're finding that linear thinking keeps producing more of the same, that it takes a lot longer to manage the changes you want, your teams or key people lack vision, cohesion and are underperforming, then your business is in need of creativity. The solution I offer we switch off to switch on is to enable business people to switch off their linear thinking and switch on their creativity. Because we are using the whole brain, it allows new thinking to emerge, blocks to be cleared and insights to surface swiftly. And its holistic approach improves well-being. By opening up their creativity, groups and teams will discover, as did Visit Britain, one of my clients, that it allows them to get back to what they do and who they are and what they love about their role. And they form a special bond. Bringing performance poetry, people and businesses together and making a difference is something I'm excited and passionate about. Once in the creative space, people find their hearts, minds and souls are nourished, as well as learning new resources such as reflection, which improves productivity, and the benefits of emotional engagement. And it's fun too. Because we're working with the arts, a fruitful mix of poetry, theatre and stand-up comedy, you'll find that some of the resources you discover will improve leadership, communication, be that interpersonal or external, and presentation skills. Poetry opens up the ways in which we use language, our thinking, and it requires the art of listening. Comedy and theatre techniques show how humour in leadership as well as communication can be enhanced and confidence boosted for presentation skills. Switch Off to Switch On is tailored to your brief, either as a one-day workshop or a programme. You'll find that the process goes to the heart of whatever the issue is. 
The swiftness of the process is due to the fact that participants are working with metaphor, their creativity, and are in a safe and supported space. From this, the business coaching then gets in on the act to ease out the insights, blocks and inspiration. <clears throat> it's been described by one client, the managing director of 360 Degrees Vision Training, as a powerful and unique way to opening up deeper insights into important personal and business challenges. Hey presto, by the end of the workshop, your key people are fired up, confident in their roles and tasks, and the fear and uncertainty of change has dissolved. This is why businesses need creativity. My finale for this video is a poem. One that was co-created from a workshop. It's how we usually conclude the day. It provides a unique aid memoir and defines the workshop. What's more, research has shown that reading or listening to poetry aids well-being. So please, take a moment to relax, breathe, and shift your focus to this painting. It's called The Gate by Andy Davis, an artist I collaborate with. If you're sitting comfortably, I'll begin. Soft through the trees. I have been left, bereft, ill at ease, in winter's work, buried. Now lifting my green leaves and branches into the cooling breeze, I feel my buds ready to unfold. White clouds are passing, floating to the seas, as sunlight shines through the fibre of my leaves, showing them naked. The first day of spring is soft through the trees.